Well, my goal in, in launching this whole project was uh, to bring practical therapies to patients. We're looking for solutions that can make a difference in people's lives. Uh, tangible solutions, therapeutic modalities uh, that can hopefully cure uh, very difficult diseases. The cell-based immunotherapy involves essentially genetically modifying our immune cells to attack diseases that are within our body. Just like you would think about vaccinations as a permanent way of preventing infections, immune and cell therapy is a permanent way of preventing certain diseases from recurring. Now that promise has never been there before. The Brown Center for Immunotherapy is going to make it possible to cure some cancers that up to this point we thought were incurable. And I know that sounds like a really bold statement, but the advances that have been made in this field, both in understanding the genetics of cancer so that we have the blueprints of these common tumors, but also the advances that have been made in cellular immunotherapy make it possible to think about ways of treating cancer that we never have before and the early results with this have been incredibly exciting. The center here will make that possible in Indiana. I'm hopeful, I'm very optimistic that with the right resources, uh, with the right people, in 10 years we can be at a place where uh, a much broader range of cancers are nothing more than chronic conditions, maybe even acute conditions in, in some cases that can be completely eradicated and that we're able to effectively deal with a, a far larger number of, of diseases that we can certainly manage autoimmune diseases and maybe even neurodegenerative diseases using some of the breakthroughs that will come as a result of this center. I mean, it's, it's fantastic that Dr. Brown was able to give this money to uh, research, obviously, again, selfishly, that, that benefits us. Having targeted research towards my disease is just, it's, it's fantastic. I, I, I can't thank Dr. Brown enough for that. The fact that Dr. Brown understands that, he's willing to donate $30 million to Indiana to do immunotherapy so that my husband may have a cure in five years, uh, speechless.